Hey, it's Adam with Sotomoto. I'm here with the Deshabo for the Bring a Trailer auction, and we've decided to get a little bit of extra video of the undercarriage. Right now it's December 6th at about 5 o'clock p.m. We're going to upload this uh, hopefully this evening. Uh, so anyway, we'll just uh, take a look at the undercarriage. So rear bumpers, uh, folks have confirmed that these are Belgian-style rear bumpers. Uh, they're bolted on back here. So we'll just look at the side of the chassis. The driver's side chassis looks nice. Uh, there's a little bit of deformation right here. A little deformation right here. The rear lip on the steel looks pretty good. The under lip here on the fender looks good. The inside of the fender looks good. There's a little bit of a uh, separation in the pinch here, but I think it looks good. Uh, some questions around the fuel tank. So there's a little bit of a deformation here uh, Paint is flaking uh, So again the rest of the chassis I think looks good uh, The spare tire well looks good the fuel tank obviously looks good Probably need to put some fuel in it uh, Here we've got some grease coming out of the rear suspension uh, The frame along here looks good um, there's a little bit of deformation along the body here on the driver's side, but it looks, I'd say, pretty darn good. The uh, steel on the underside of the, the door area has some deformation, but I think overall it looks pretty good. This uh, transverse member here looks pretty good, both sides. The floor obviously has some you know, heavy paint on it, but I think it looks nice. Uh, on the passenger side, there's a few things that are worth noting. The chassis itself looks quite good, uh, but as you come under the door, there is this section right here, right where this uh, you know, transverse uh, member is, where you've actually got some you know, rust through. There's a, a hole there. Pinch weld looks pretty good. Uh, again, looking at the frame from this perspective, adjacent to the tank, there is this dent here. All right, we'll continue moving up. Hands look good. Front suspension looks pretty good. Axles feel nice and tight. Driver's side, same thing, no, no perceptible play, no looseness in those. Uh, oil, I haven't tried to wipe anything up, but uh, you know, the oil level hasn't changed in the maybe 100 miles that we've driven it in the last uh, couple of months. Uh, underside of the front bumper looks pretty good. 